Hey guys, what's up? So, <clears throat> we haven't really been posting just little videos here and there because we are all very ill. I actually feel great today, but um, we are actually going to be taking Keikoa to the ER right now. Um, we call this pediatrician. He is high fever. Um, can't keep get him to drink fluids. He'll drink a little bit, but he is lethargic and falling asleep. He's over here. So I'm just waiting for Cruz and Logan to come home from Boy Scouts, and then me and him are going to the ER. Um, I <clears throat> usually would just take him in, but I called the on call because we've been there quite a few times in the last few weeks because the kids, um, Vincent had croup last week. But <clears throat> because of his history, the doctor wants him to be seen tonight and not wait till tomorrow because he's concerned um, that his with his mouth being dry and the fever not going down all the way, that he's dehydrating himself. So... And he's not acting himself. He's not using the bathroom, um, which this happened when he went septic last year. So we are actually just going to hope it's the flu. Um, I have to repeat what he did last year where he went septic and he got really, really ill and just, it just wasn't fun for anybody. And um, I mean, I don't want him to have the flu. Don't, don't get me wrong there, but I want him to be better. We kind of checked through his skin. We didn't see anywhere that looked infected. Like last year when he got sepsis, sepsis, it, we saw access through his hand and his hand was swollen and pussy and gross. And we don't see anything like that. Um, but it's always a concern with how severe his eczema is that there is a possibility of infection at some point and that he could get really sick because of it. So, um, we're going to take him in and just get him checked out. Um, maybe get him to give, get them to give him a bag of, of fluids, um, because he hasn't had any liquids today. Um, we've been trying to push fluids and this is all we've gotten in the last four hours. So we can't get him to stay awake. It's just been a nightmare. So I'll keep you guys posted, but keep him in your prayers when we get down and we'll see, um, just keep them in your prayers. Why do you keep doing that? That's weird. Uh, yeah. <laughs> feeling. Hey, how you feeling? Hey guys, we are in the ER room. They gave him some Motrin, did a strep swab, and then did a flu swab as well. Um, influence is going around pretty tough right now, so it's definitely possible that he has influenza, is what they're thinking. If those come back negative, then they're going to run blood work because he's had skin infections before, and the doctor said if those come back negative, he's worried that that's what this is. So, yeah, I'll keep you guys up to date, but... We're just waiting now. He's tired. He's gonna go back to sleep. So bad for the poor kid. Never can catch a break. So, yeah, we'll keep up with you guys later. I'm gonna sit back and play on my phone and watch whatever this is. The regular show? No, that's not right. I don't know what's on TV. It's the only thing that looks cartoonish. Which I'm thinking it's probably not appropriate after listening to the words. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll let you guys know. Poor guy. I feel like as soon as he starts going better, he gets worse again, so. This is our life with him. So, catch you guys later. Bye. Well, we came home from the ER probably around midnight last night. Um, he was diagnosed with strep throat. So he's on antibiotics and... We're alternating Motrin and Tylenol. I'm waiting for my mom to get off because she's gonna bring me some more Motrin because um, he has a 104 degree fever right now. We gave him Tylenol at huh? like nine.
Um, so we're almost to where we can give him more time. Pretty much been sleeping all day. I feel so bad for him, but um, yeah. That's this little turd here. Vincent, huh? Eee! Oh, Sloppy had to make his appearance again. But yeah, I'll keep you guys posted, but yeah, he's pretty sick, so. It's a huge bummer. But anyways, bye. If you would like to continue to follow our journey, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like, and share. Thank you guys for all the support. We love you guys.